my dear student, I am taking some in the student to teach you. Suppose you do it. प्यारे विद्यार्थियों आइसोसलिस ट्राइंगल कैसी होती है जिसकी दो साइडें बराबर हो तो थ्योरम क्या है किसी भी आइसोसलिस ट्राइंगल के अंदर यदि उसकी दो साइडें बराबर हैं होती हैं तो वह कहता है कि जो साइडें बराबर हैं उनके साथ वाले एंगल भी अपोजिट एंगल्स विल आल्सो बी इक्वल यानी उनके अपोजिट एंगल जैसे ए बी का अपोजिट एंगल कौन सा है सी एंड ए सी का अपोजिट एंगल कौन सा बी इक्वल सो गिवन दिस इज ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थर्म प्लीज टेक इट सीरियसली आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू दिस थर्म नाउ गिवन वट इज गिवन ए बी सी इज एन आइसोसलिस ट्राइंगल इफ दिस इज आइसोसलिस therefore ab is equal to ac this is the given sec to prove angle b is equal to c ye humne prove karna hai ke angle b c ke barabar hai ye isosceles triangle hai dhyan se sun lijiye ye isosceles triangle hai jisme side ab is equal to ac ye dono side barabar hain aur humne siddh kya karna hai angle b is equal to angle c अब क्या है कंस्ट्रक्शन कंस्ट्रक्शन में क्या करेंगे हम ए एंगल का बाई सेक्टर खींचेंगे ए डी ए डी इज द बाई सेक्टर इज द बाई सेक्टर ऑफ एंगल ए दिस इज द बाई सेक्टर ऑफ एंगल ए हियर AD. It means this angle one is equal to two. ये bisector. AD is the bisector of angle A. It means angle. Therefore, angle one is equal to angle two. Now proof. In triangles, in triangles, कौन कौन सी triangle लेंगे? ABD, A. B D and दूसरी triangle कौन सी A C D and triangle A C D कह रहे विद्यार्थियों अभी हम दो triangle लेंगे इन दोनों को congruent सिद्ध करेंगे कैसे A B is equal to A C A B is equal to A C given and A D is equal to A D common A D is equal to A D कॉमन दोनों में जो है ये कॉमन है दोनों ट्राइंगल में ये कॉमन साइड है एंड एंगल वन इज इक्वल टू टू कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड एंगल वन इज इक्वल टू टू ये किससे कंस्ट्रक्शन से हमने अभी कंस्ट्रक्शन में किया है इसलिए ट्राइंगल ए बी डी कॉन्ग्रवेंट टू ट्राइंगल ए सी डी When two triangles are congruent, जब दोनों triangle congruent हो जाती है तो उसके सभी angle और साइड मैं ऊपर लिखता हूं यहां कभी आपको दिखाई नहीं देगा यहां यहां लिख देता हूं देर फोर यहां लिखता हूं देर फोर एंगल बी इज इक्वल टू एंगल सी एंगल बी इज इक्वल टू एंगल सी यानी हेयर Angle B is equal to angle C. Hence, proved. This is the last part. You see, after triangle congruency, this is the last part. There, this implies angle B is equal to angle C. Hence, proved. This is the theorem. So, my dear students, in this theorem, you have seen. when an isosceles triangle is given then the angles of the opposite side equal of, angles of the opposite sides of equal sides are also equal
now one example one example my dear students example or you can say one question in an isosceles triangle one angle is given in an isosceles triangle one angle one angle find out the other two angle other two angles my dear students this is the question now see this question an isosceles triangle this is an isosceles triangle abc abc is an isosceles triangle and angle a is 100 degree given a is equal to angle a is is equal to 100 degree it means this implies that angle b plus c is it then angle b plus c plus angle a is equal to 180 degree here angle a is equal to 100 degree angle b plus c plus a is equal to 180 degree because uh, some of all the triangles of a triangle is equal to 180 degree but here you see ab but uh, ab is equal to ac given ab is equal to ac given angle a is equal to 100 given ye bhi given hai Uh, we, it means according to the theorem which you have read when ab is equal to ac it means this implies angle b is equal to angle c theorem ab ye bhi theorem first jo maine karai uske according when sides are equal then angles will also equal just we have proved this theorem in first part now next angle a plus angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree after this is aage chal raha hu main ye udhar angle a plus b plus c is equal to 180 degree because we know that the sum of all angles of a triangle sir is equal to 180 degree here angle a a angle put the value of a 100 degree plus angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree minus 100 angle b plus angle c is equal to uh, 80 degree but here you see b plus c is equal to 180 degree but here b is equal to c according to theorem b is equal to c it means 80 by 2 angle b is equal to angle c is equal to 40 degree see here dono ka sum asi hai b aur c ka sum 80 hai dono equal hai to iska matlab kitna hua 80 ko 2 se divide kar do 40 iska matlab b aur c angle dono kitne honge 40 degree ke understand my point this is the uh, question according to the theorem which you have read in this second part what was the theorem if opposite sides are in isosceles triangle if opposite sides are equal if two sides are equal then the opposite angles of these sides are all also equal this is the statement of the theorem and hence this question is based on the uh, theorem so do
some more question from your textbook and uh, in the last i want to make a request to you please subscribe the channel i shall be very thankful to you